Mhm. Gucken wir uns natürlich erst den Wagen an. Das war wichtig. Mhm. Die Steuerung von dem Spiel ist ein bisschen blöd. Ist man, glaube ich, ich will mal, glaube ich, auch eher mit mit äh, den Controller, glaube ich. das hier an. So this is where they've been sending these. Mhm. Big B Wolf. The big bad wolf. <laughs> also, we can go. <laughs> Wo immer auch Bloody Mary gerade ist. You used to be something. Wir wurden also die ganze Zeit beobachtet. Und andere wurden beobachtet. Auf jeden Fall ging hier eine Blutspur lang. Mhm. Da stellen wir jetzt die Silberkugeln her. <lacht> Diesmal machen wir es aber kalt. Wahrscheinlich hinter dir. War wahrscheinlich nicht so clever, da hoch zu klettern. Ich 
Benutzt deine Spinnensinne. Das war zu langsam. Die hört sich gruselig an. Die ist einfach zu schnell für dich. Jetzt ist er wach. Okay. Bigby, das kannst du, glaube ich, nicht gewinnen. Ach ja, die andere Wolfsform. So groß ist übrigens Chocolate auch ungefähr. Uiuiui, das ist ziemlich spannend gerade. Oh, 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 ja. Denn der große böse Wolf kann ja, glaube ich, noch etwas. Und das wird er jetzt hoffentlich machen. Ja.
<laughs> Hello, Bigby. You look tired. Give me one good reason not to rip you apart right now. This gun <laughs> holds six rounds of specially... I won't miss next time. Before you do anything with me, I thought I should point out a few things. Snow White wants you to bring me back to the woodlands, doesn't she? And that's what I want. Snow's not here. You're dealing with me now. That may be true, but I'd advise against defying your new boss, at least for the time being. You will bring me back alive. Look, all I ask for is the chance to speak for myself in front of the community. And I'm sure Miss White would agree that I should be given a fair trial. Can we at least agree on that? I will have a trial. Are we clear? You need to tell me right now. We're not going anywhere until I get some answers from you. If you want answers, you're going to have to cooperate with me. Look, there's no reason for us to be at each other's throats here. That's funny, coming from a guy pointing a gun at my head. This is just a precaution. I'm sure you understand. I'm no murderer, Mr. Wolf. I didn't kill those women. And I think you know that. All I'm asking for is a chance to explain my side of the story. If you're not a killer, then what are you? I'm a businessman, not a killer. There's still a lot you have to answer for. And I will, as long as you agree to my terms. Because I'm not saying another word until I'm brought before the community. I don't mean to belabor the point, but just so we're clear, if you change your mind and decide to do something stupid, you won't get your answers. But you will have a difficult time explaining yourself to Miss White and the rest of this miserable town. You're often reckless, and I worry you're not thinking of the... Let me ask you an honest question. What do you really care about here? Where this case is concerned, I mean. Do you really want the truth? Or do you just want to look like the hero? I'm doing this for Faith, because she and Lily died, and someone is gonna answer for that! Then why are you here? You know who murdered them. Georgie. He's dead, isn't he? My point being, the killer has been dealt with. You've won. You really think I'm that stupid? I understand you have an obligation to bring me in. But you can brighten up a little. It's over. So, shall we get going? I'd rather not dawdle. Naja, Snow wollte das. Let's go. Hand over the gun. I think I'd rather hold on to it, if you don't mind. What do you say? Ja, damit. Hey. I'm sure Miss White will be pleased. Such a reliable pub. I understand why she'd want to keep you around. You're under arrest. You'll be given a trial in front of your peers. <clears throat> And your punishment will follow. Ob wir jetzt alles richtig gemacht haben? Hm? Ich weiß nicht, ob es da überhaupt richtig oder falsch gibt. Schauen wir mal. Schon wieder ein Steam Achievement. I know, I know. But we have to do something. Are you fucking kidding me? When is this thing happening? Are we sure he's coming? Yes, you'll have an opportunity to... He's back. <gasps> The crooked man. Thank God. Motherfucker. Are you okay? It's been hours. We were worried you'd run into some trouble. At the crooked man's place. Well, he didn't make it easy. What happened? It doesn't matter. He's here. We got him. We can talk about it later. You did well, Sheriff. I'm surprised. Not that you did well, but that, you know... I'm just glad you made it back in one piece. 
It's about time you showed up. Now throw this asshole down the fucking well. Yes, what are you waiting for? You killed Lily! She was my sister! How could what you? do you have to say for Where yourself? the fuck do you get this off? You think you have the right and to just do this me? to people? You're a fucking to crook! This. You should fucking be ashamed. Shit hole. Everyone, can I have your attention? Thank you all for coming here on such short notice. I know normally we'd schedule a formal hearing, but considering the circumstances, I thought it best if we do this as soon as possible. The crooked man is charged with the murder as of I Faith and... As I already informed your sheriff, it was Mr. Georgie Porgy who killed those women, not me. What? It was Georgie? Georgie? I don't mean to interrupt you, Miss White. Georgie may have killed them, but you made the call. Do I have to explain the situation to you again? Wait a minute. So you're saying Georgie's the motherfucker who killed my sister? Well, where is he? Yeah, you're gonna bring that shithead in too, aren't you? Yes, yeah, sheriff. Where is that rotten scoundrel now? Is he still out there? I sincerely hope not. Well, where is he? I killed him. He's dead. He's... what? Dead. So you see, the culprit has been punished. There's no That doesn't change anything. We'll deal with it later, but right now, you're the one I'm concerned with. You called the shots. Georgie made that perfectly clear. In which case, you still have a lot to answer for. And I was I told don't... I would be allowed to speak. We have to read the rest of the charges. What other charges? If you'd wait a moment. Let her finish. Then you can have your say. Got it? If you insist. <clears throat> you are charged with the murder of Faith and Lily, which Georgie carried out on your order, inciting violence against various members of the Fabletown community, including the attempted murder of Sheriff Bigby Wolf. Twice. A misunderstanding. Aiding and providing monetary support for the forced prostitution at the Pudding and Pie. Additionally, you are charged with multiple counts of fraud, extortion, racketeering, and the illegal possession and sale of magical artifacts. Now, is there anything you would like to say? <clears throat> First of all, I had nothing to do with Faith and Lily, so you can strike that one from your little record book. Bullshit! Like hell you Stop didn't. the charade. We know you're involved. Come on, it's obvious. And there's all the other crap he's done. Everyone just shut up for a minute. If you wanted a chance to talk, well go ahead. What? We all know he's guilty. What the fuck does he need to speak for? The crooked man has committed crimes against this government, and most importantly, its citizens. These charges, if proven, are enough to justify death. Upon which your body will be committed to the witching where it fucking belongs. That's so right. let's get but on with it. We promised you a chance to defend yourself, and I won't rob you of that right. What the You're fuck? Really going this to is let about him talk? justice. If we're ever going to pull ourselves together and make something of this town, we have to start doing things correctly. No more snap judgments, no more secrets. We are going to treat everyone fairly, even when they don't deserve it. This is ridiculous. You have the floor. Thank you, Miss White. You've all met Georgie. I don't have to tell you what kind of person he was. He was a total scoundrel, lacking in any sort of moral fiber. I hired him as a favor to his family, you see. A promise kept to a dying mother. Oh, Are you gonna get to your point or what? Georgie was working for me, yes. But he was not acting on my behalf when he killed those women. It was his business. And for whatever reason, I'm sure only he could understand, he murdered two of his most faithful employees. I had nothing to do with it. This, this is such bullshit! He's always been a bit of a powder keg. It was only a matter of time before something like this happened. Give me a break. You're so full of shit. Well, I thought we could discuss this like civilized people. But apparently For that isn't going sake. to happen. Any of you actually believe this bullshit? Holly, please. Tell them, Bigby. When you finally showed up at my door last night, wasn't I more than helpful? I answered your questions. I was willing to cooperate. What's he talking about? Yeah, and your goons attacked me. Did you forget that part? They get a bit carried away sometimes, it's true. Loyal to the end. They do it because they want to protect me, as I've protected them. You understand wanting to protect what you care about, don't you? You'd do anything. You might even give up an innocent man just to save someone. 
What's he talking about? I really hope you're going somewhere with this. I see. You want to cut right to the point. I can appreciate that. Let me explain this to you. My employees are just that. Hired help. I see some of them are here among you. They are not my slaves. They are all free to make their own decisions, as Georgie was. What about Lily? She wasn't free. She wasn't given a choice. Do you really think she wanted... that any of those girls wanted their lives like that? I'm sorry, Holly. I'm sorry that your sister asked me for help, and I'm sorry that I decided against my better judgment to give her a distasteful job. Right, and you kept them in debt so they couldn't leave. Yeah. That's what you did to us. How you kept us all you in You forget, line. it was not me who put you in that position. You all act like I'm some kind of tyrant. 